Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Are you awake yet? Hello? Wake up. There you are. So, you mind telling me why you were snooping around? You have nothing to say, huh? That's fine with me. In all seriousness, I could just kill you right now so no one knows where you went. But... You might have some... valuable information about the heroes. So... I'm gonna keep you here. Just for now. You know, you pro heroes are really predictable. Getting yourself caught like this, I thought you'd be taught more into stealth missions than anything. But I guess heroes don't always think of everything, do they? <laughs> so, I'm going to be asking you a few questions. And you're going to answer me, or I'm going to burn every single part of your skin until there's nothing left. That was just an example. So tell me, who sent you? I know it was the hero organization. Don't get smart with me. Who sent you? Okay. What was your purpose of snooping around my organization then? Well, if you're looking for our boss, he's not here. You really think I'm going to tell you where he is? You must be stupid or something. You can try, but I promise you, you're not going to find anything here. Not a single trace of him was left here because of our... New cooperatives. Well, since you have our main guy who was basically our transportation locked up, we found a few more people who know exactly what they're doing. And despite of being a little bit younger than me, they still know how to follow rules. I could say the same thing to you, hero. You're training kids to become professional heroes, aren't you? Setting them up into dangerous situations. Kind of sounds like a setup to me. Kind of sounds like you're the one being held responsible for those kids' injuries. And also their deaths. A lot of people think we're the villains. But in all reality... You're the one setting up our future to their demise. Now who looks like a villain? <laughs> I 
Don't give me that look now. I'm not done with you yet. So, I'm gonna ask you another question. Why did you become a hero? Was it for the money, fame, or even protection? No, it had to be something bigger than that. Well, whatever it is, you might as well give up on your dreams right now. Because those same heroes are doing exactly what you're doing. Sitting up for your death. Well, I mean, if you become a villain, then you have your own free will. All you have to do is just follow our boss's orders. And then you can do whatever you want freely. As long as you're not on a mission, of course. I'm asking... Well... I'm more of telling you... That you should just become a villain. Well, for starters... We're not here to protect you. We're here because we want liberation. We want freedom. And we will do it in any means necessary. Even if that means killing a few heroes off. We've done it before. So, who says we're not going to do it again? Oh, like we care about their families. The difference between you and me is that you can't control your emotions as well as your actions. But me, I'm a bit different than you. A lot of us villains are a lot different than you heroes. Showing nothing but sympathy and making sure the rest of the world is safe while you're trying to go one-on-one -on -one with someone who you know is stronger than you. Pathetic plays. It's all a bunch of pathetic plays. And you are the actors. Set up by government. So they can control you like strings on a puppet. Makes me sick to my stomach just even talking about it. Oh, won't we? Look at yourself. Do you really think you'll win this war? I've already captured you and put you into this situation. If you see me again, you know that will be the end of your chapter. <laughs> you heroes are so predictable. All right. I've ran out of questions for you. Well, let me put something into your memory. Something you can think about before you die. <sighs> well, I mean, I could tell you everything. But you're not going to remember everything. Because, well, there's not going to be anything for you to remember. Because after I'm done with you, you're nothing but a pile of ash to me. And I'll blow you against the wind. You heroes disgust me. And now I'm done with you. 
Say goodbye, hero. A poor man's decision of a hero really shouldn't be put on government hands. Let's get this war started.